Good afternoon. My name is Mustafa Gulsen, and my father's name is Yilmaz, my mother's name is Nurjan. The reason of making this uh, conversation, which we made it approximately one and a half hour uh, record, and another uh, national newspaper as a informed to Turkish and Germany's uh, embassy in Rabat uh, to solve some paradox, not a problem, just paradox. Uh, because uh, I have uh, three birth dates and two birth places. According to those three birth dates, which is my original birthday, uh, 23 May 1964, and uh, very same time, according to my father and mother's uh, notary marriage in Consulate General in München, uh, is going to be, uh, was, not is, was, uh, 14 November uh, 1964, and around year 2070, exact demo, uh, year 2070, uh, they got uh, divorced one more time, and that time, they changed my birth dates, uh, November 14 to May, 14 May 1964. Uh, 23 May, November 14th, and May 14th. I have uh, three birth dates uh, on both countries' records, plus in Strasbourg, which is uh, recorded to my father's uh, member of European Union passport. Also, that passport has been given in uh, March 31st, 1964, uh, just three months before I was born in München uh, Consulate General. Uh, according to all those infos, uh, are exist in all those Turkish passports and my records anyway. But uh, when I keep searching again and again, same situations to look, is there any other Mustafa Gulsen or Mustafa Biricik, which is my mother's last name, exist? Uh, I have been searched at uh, year 2002, and I published three books. And those two books, uh, one of them are republished also. And uh, those time, I couldn't find any other Mustafas. Now we have five Mustafas, and the trouble is, after year 2002, from after this book, I got married, and which Mustafa has been get married with my uh, wife Yasemin Gulsen, plus who is the uh, father of my child, which is me, of course, it's kind of dark comedy, but uh, the trouble is still exists since I was born. The trouble is, 1964 to 1970, they duplicate my father's passport and my father's identity as a Mehmet Akif in Turkey. And also, Germany have all those details on their record too, uh, because I have been two times orphanage in Germany and has been record on their uh, system Jugend's armed system as a Mr. Gulsen, who was born in Germany with two birth dates, uh, May 23, November 14, and the other one is born in Istanbul, uh, November 14 to uh, May 14. And I grew up as a May 14 uh, person. Uh, May 14, 1964, person, and with one identity entire of my life, uh, universities, all my documentations and everything, including in United States, 1988, I got this social security number with that too, and I exist on Federal Bureau uh, records, all my cars, all my education master program, this, that, my taxes, also tax returns, exist, including uh, one marriage too, which is survived only a couple months because of uh, this 
things which I didn't even know they have been questioning that. Of course, they are going to question because there is another Mustafa exists on the records. Now, what I find is uh, we, ha we have uh, five passport records according to uh, cases, actually. And those uh, passport cases uh, creates three different Mustafas. I mean, mother's child, father's child, and maybe orphanage by itself. Uh, but the, uh, besides creating a problem, like a diplomatic problem or something, I was speaking to uh, both countries' highest commissioner, which is in Rabat, to sit and talk this subject only five or ten minutes, because all those records are clear as a crystal, to figure out how to survive my future, also my child's future, too. And uh, I have only eight minutes to talk in here, uh, plus a couple more minutes, maybe. But uh, we don't want to make it uh, more complicated. And I know it's not as simple, but the paradox is I'm only one. I mean, we cannot create another Mustafa according to all those documents. Uh, what I realize with the other uh, Mustafa Biricik identity uh, is exist in Germany. If we couldn't erase that Mustafa Biricik identity in Germany, we cannot erase that Mustafa Biricik identity in Turkey. Even we done that, uh, Mustafa Biricik identity will be exist in Germany. So we have three Mustafas in Germany, three Mustafas in Turkey as a uh, Mustafa Gulsen, as a Mustafa Biricik, and as a Mustafa Guelsen. Even my child has been born on, the, on his birth certificate as a Mustafa Guelsen because they were questioning or try to prove, uh, to prove, am I the right Mustafa or not? Also, they must, should, would, could know that because all those records are exist as a tree. Uh, Mustafa Gulsen, Mustafa Biricik, and as a uh, Mustafa Gulsen born three birth dates in Strasbourg, plus those days uh, capital Bonn, Bonn record has that too. My birthplace, Heidenheim under Brands, uh, also have my original birth date and original document of my father's and mother's history. Uh, they are uh, Yilmaz and Nurjan, and they have been given birth to me as a Gulsen family. I mean, I didn't born without family, or I didn't get adapted or something. I'm not an adapted person or something. Could be possible as an orphanage, but it's not. And uh, what else? As a last word, and also all those uh, records are uh, clear as a crystal on the uh, passport records, I have been registered Istanbul to my father's registration 1965 August in Istanbul, and that has been proved from Ankara too. So, which means Ankara have uh, all those records too. But uh, that's finally impossible to fix it, both country plus any. Uh, European Union countries too. That's why I came three months ago from European Union country to uh, Morocco, which is Africa, to keep on going to South to get out from their geography to solve this trouble. Because it's not a matter of geography leaving place things, but it's a matter of uh, administrational mistakes. They are keep asking me who is guilty. There is no guilt. There is a mistake. Both country made some mistakes around year 2000. I mean, year uh, 1970s, and covered up that mistakes. And all my identity has been plundered naturally. All my bank account, even in Boston, Bay Bank, <laughs> Bank of Boston, etc. All my credibilities are gone. All my cars, boats, house, etc., etc., has been vanished. And uh, as a last word, uh, from 88 through year 2001, I was living in States. And entire of my life, I lived in, uh, as a Turkish citizen. 
uh, born as a Turkish citizen to lady situations was asking for asylum to fix these things to take pay attention for both countries ad administrations uh, in Rabat uh, embassies, Turkish and German, and also French is involved with Strasbourg uh, regulations, rules and regulations. So European Union is terribly not the places to live for me. And uh, latest shortcut, I ask for volunteer deportation, even if it's necessary to go back to Turkey. And I'm asking from all administration people to fix this situations because I'm all my work rights and social rights has been vanished. Uh, thank you for listening and uh, paying attention, especially uh, for this news media uh, people. And uh, I hope uh, we can get some response from Turkish ministry highest ministry in German ministry in Rabat uh, embassies, ambassadors to uh, take pay attention to their government highest foreign ministry uh, people.